Guys, stop fighting. Yo, 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 everyone, welcome to another vlog. Now, the other day, one of you emailed me, and that's how I'm gonna start today's vlog, based on that email. And they sent me a video, five things you probably didn't know about your Mustang. And I can't lie, two of them were super cool, and I had no idea existed. So I'm gonna take you out and show you what I mean. Maybe you guys own a Mustang and don't know this too. All right, let's open the door. I hope there's no cats outside. Oh yeah, we're good, we're good. By the way, I'm in my flip flops. So the first feature I had no idea about, which I found pretty awesome is, apparently, by the way, this is the first time I'm trying it. If you hit your unlock button twice and hold it on the second time, your window comes down. So let's test it out. So here goes nothing guys, let's see if this actually works. The guy actually held it very long in the video, so let's try it ourselves. One, two, okay. Whoa, whoa, it actually comes down guys. That is epic. If you wonder there's a way to get it back up though, cause the video didn't mention anything. Let's try it for ourselves. Maybe we can make up something. Let's do the same thing. One, two. Okay, I don't think that works. So that's a pretty cool feature anyways. So I'm not exactly sure what the feature is for because why would you want to roll down your windows when you're not in your car, but I guess there's a function for it, which I have no idea about. So let me know in the comment section. So the second thing is actually something in your car, which you probably don't know about. And that's the reason I actually wore my glasses. So I'm going to show you a hidden compartment that I didn't even know existed. This is the view you get when you're sitting in your car. Pretty standard, right? You have your steering wheel. And then when you come to your right, you have your sat nav. And there's not much else you're going to look for. Now, if you come to the left, however, this over here, this is what you use to open your boot, I believe so. And then this thing right here, I just never really paid attention to. It was just something there. But if you click on this, there is a hidden compartment for your sunglasses. And it's actually padded up. Like inside, it's got this little padding. Okay, let's see if my glasses actually fit in there. And there you go, guys. Two features you probably didn't know about your Mustang, which are pretty cool. To be honest, I didn't know that. It also opens your passenger side window when you do that unlock thing. However, there's one more thing that a lot of you keep asking me. It's Mo, show the engine of your car. I'm gonna be super honest with you. I don't even know how to open the front. So I think we have to learn it right now so I can show you my engine. I never thought I'd do this, but I have to actually get the manual to find out how to open my hood. Like there's no, but I can't see anything in this car that opens the hood. Like. There's legit no button. I can't find anything in this car. Like, look around. Help me out, guys. What is it? This is for the boot. This is my sunglasses. There's no more buttons. Like, what? All right. While we're doing that, though, I can show you one more thing you probably don't know about. But look at that. That's an extra storage compartment. But I didn't want to show you because I knew about it. I'm so selfish like that. Oh, is that... Wait, is that something for the hood? Okay, no, that's nothing. All right, let's see. Owner's manual, please. Please be very simple. Okay. Oh my God, guys. Midway through recording my video, look at where Bubbles is. He is so high up that tree and he has no idea how to get down. Please don't fall. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, slowly. Oh. Okay, he's down. Why did you go so high? Are you okay? Like, look, look at the pieces of the tree that fell. Don't do that, you're gonna hurt yourself one day. I finally found out how to open the hood. I'll show you why it's so impossible to see, okay? Okay, tell me if you guys can see how to open the hood. It was so dark. Okay, wait, no, no, this doesn't even prove my point. Okay, wait, wait. Look at that. When this is closed and you're looking here, you can barely see anything in that corner. It's that thing in that corner and when the door is closed, it's so dark. But when it's open, you can pretty much see it. So let's go ahead and pull it. All right, I finally did it. You had to pull a bit harder. So, do I need anything? Okay, wait, let's look. Let's look where. Here you go, guys. I finally managed to do it after like 10 minutes of playing around. 
that is what the engine looks like it actually looks really really cool all right so we have v8 let's see if we can count it one two three four five six seven eight so let's try and get a better shot for you there you go four of them on this side four of them on that side it's actually a pretty big engine when you look at it like wow but yeah, there you go. That is the engine of my car. I've had an insane amount of comments saying, Mo, you didn't show us the engine and stuff like that. So I finally figured out how to open the boot. Not the boot, the bonnet. And yeah, that's how the engine looks like. I'm not sure if I just completely missed this on the vlog. Or did you guys see it the whole time? But there's a letter on my car which says, To Mo. I promise you, like, I did not plant that there, like... Was it there the whole time which I was opening my boot and I didn't see it? I need to rewatch the footage. What the hell? I'm such an idiot. Regardless, let's take it and open it up inside. I think I feel a coin in there and a note maybe. All right, let's open this letter and see what's inside it. Like, imagine if I missed it and drove off with it. That could have been a possibility, but I guess it was meant to be. Do we have anything to open this? Let's take a, take a pen. All right, let's open this bad boy and see what's inside it. So, I was right because there is a note and a coin. Hey Mo, my name is Adel, I'm 16 years old, I'm from Russia and I live in Dubai. You and a couple of other YouTubers inspired me to do videos, I don't know why, but every time I watch your vlogs I get motivated to create content. Oh, okay, so apparently this is no longer produced in Russia, so it's like a limited edition note. And this is five rubles, which is a coin. Wish you the best of luck. Peace out. Say hi to Lana and Mummy Mo. Thank you so much, Ardo, for bringing this by. You should have come and said hi. Like, I didn't even get to meet you. But thank you for the awesome money. I'll definitely add this into the collection. And yeah, I've said hi to Mummy Mo and Lana because they're like... Lana's upstairs and my mom's recording me. Hi, mommy. Hi. <laughs> so we're actually going to be rushing over to the hospital now because for about a week, my sister's arm has been really hurting her. And we thought it would go away, but it hasn't. So we're going to see what's up. Hopefully nothing, but it's better to check because I don't think it's normal for your arm to feel dead for a week. You ready to go to the doctors? Yeah. Which arm is it, by the way? Oh, so you can open a door with the arm. Yeah, but it hurts. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Because we need to rush over quickly, it only makes sense that I speed. No, it doesn't. Dude, this is for, this yeah, is for no, you. you're such a liar. <laughs> I'm going to be speeding safely. for you. No, I'm here you go, take the camera. I'm getting stressed out and then I'll die probably because of stress. I'm trying to save your life here, okay? No, you're just doing as you want to do. I'm trying to save your life here. Yeah, well, if you drive safely, I'll be happier. Less stress. Mom, it. I could take myself to the hospital, otherwise if Why I'm going to stress you? out. Because when I drive, I'm worried about my right hand on the steering wheel, but yeah. Alright, so we're finally here. Not somewhere my sister's new to, she comes here all the time. <laughs> So the reason I actually said it's not something my sister is new to is she's been here so many times without anything being wrong with her and that's why <laughs> she's not new to this place. Every time they're like, okay, look, okay, this time, okay, look, touch wood, nothing's wrong again, but if this time nothing's wrong, we're never bringing her back. <laughs> this place has actually got a really nice seating area, I swear, I'm bored out of my mind. How long does it take in hospitals, mum? How long? Like, look at me. I'm so bored, I just want to sleep. I haven't been to a doctor for like two years, and my sister comes like every two months. It's like she's taking my doctor duties into her own hands. You're lying. <laughs> my sister's taking way too long, and I'm pretty much starving, so the only thing there is is a vending machine, and I'm gonna get myself some crisps. Okay, I want these ones. Number 17, two dirhams, please, mommy. Guys, I don't have coins. Okay, does it tell me how much I put in? Yeah, it does. Number seven. Yes. One. Seven. Enter. Oh yeah, we got it. We got it. Oh. Not bad. It's actually pretty cold in there. You want it? No. That is 11 dirhams. <laughs> Mummy doesn't want to pay 11 for that. 
Okay, me and my mum are now on the hunt to find like a little coffee shop or something because she didn't want a little snack, she wanted like a whole meal. No, <laughs> you lied. We had no luck, like legit, there's no coffee shop in here. So I think I need to go buy another packet of crisps. That thing finished so quick. So my sister finished her consultancy and basically, <laughs> same thing man, I don't even know what consultancy means, but yeah. Tomorrow she's going in for an MRI scan. Now that's a pretty big scan. As I said, touch wood, nothing happens and it's all okay and it's some vitamin problem or something small, but we're gonna have to see tomorrow, so yeah. Anyways, let's go home guys. Oh, uh, uh, wrong car, sorry, my bad. <laughs> Bruh. Don't talk to the car like that, okay? Don't talk to him like that. He may be dirty, but he never said anything about you. Let's go. We've actually come over to this place. We used to come every single week to play some pool. It's called Q Club. It's next to Lamsey Plaza. Where is this area? No, oh, uh, what do you call the area? Uh, Bar Dubai. Bar Dubai? Yes. Yeah, but we used to come here like all the time, every single week. So what are we doing, Lana? We're looking at bubbles. She's looking at pictures she took with bubbles yesterday. Look at him, look what he does. He, he sits on my legs <laughs> and he pauses. Like, he even pauses for the picture. So we've decided to eat before we play our pool, but you know what's funny? We're about to connect to the internet and guess what their password is? It's the number two, 10 times. What the, who, who would want to type 10? Yo, I've never seen a hot dog like that. <laughs> Guys, this is legit a hot dog and it comes so fancy. It's nice. Okay, so we got our drinks. Look at that. My mommy got a heart. Yeah. Turn it. Turn it around, mama. That's pretty. And there's my mommy. Okay, and my brother. Okay, I'm, I'm here. So vote down below who you think is going to win, Team Mo or Team Lana? To be honest, I am the better pool player. My arm Oh, the excuses. My arm is not Don't worry, you don't need to hit any power shots today. Oh, she's got the easiest shot ever, man. What is this? What is life? <laughs> I thought you were gonna miss it for a second. I'm so obese, I'm getting another hot dogs over there. Obesity runs in me. <laughs> I'm legit playing like an absolute retard today. What's sad is Lana might actually win. She's gonna get too confident and play bad. Where the hell are you aiming for anymore? <laughs> My sister tied her hair back to go all serious mode on me. Okay, watch me do a skill shot, okay? You ready? Record me. I bet you people think I'm a professional because you're recording me, but this is what you call the behind the back shot, okay, guys? Oh. <laughs> it was such a good shot. Lana's finishing the game on me. She's got one more strike ball, and I've got all of these three. Who do you reckon is going to win? Did you just completely miss the ball? <laughs> oh, I jinxed you, I jinxed you. Oh, you did, you jinxed me. I suck at this game. I literally suck. Yeah, because you're eating and you're playing your <laughs> jinx. Stop eating so much. Right, I'm going to win, I'm going to win. This one. Oh, this okay. Watch this. Do that? How did you do that? If I hit this peak, then I'm gonna be ahead of you. Oh my! God. I can finish the game. Okay, that's my fault. <laughs> Rematch. Rematch. You set up the game. I'm not. I told you guys, as soon as I stopped eating, I killed you. Like, she was three balls ahead of me. Three. Oh, the excuses. Your arm's not working. No, I'm not. Come on, you know it. Oh, the excuses. The excuses. It's all about the accuracy. It's not even your arm. It's the same as before. I can keep my arm Alright, fine. We're gonna go one more time. Oh. 
Yeah. Really? Guys, guys, guys. This is the worst. One stripe and one spot. Look at that. That's pointless. Oh. One of each. You can't choose yet. No, yeah, once I hit one more and I can choose. My sister is asking me what happened and I haven't told her till now. It was her turn and she told me to snap. Okay, I snapped you. And she told me, did the shot turn out good? You didn't even hit the white ball. You hit the red ball. Are you kidding me? You hit the red ball. <laughs> can I see the snap? Please show the vlog. Please show the vlog. She had no idea until I told I her. I can't believe I hit the red ball. You just straight up smacked Look. the red ball. Wait, wait for it. Look at that. <laughs> you were so lucky there's no internet right now. Oh Unless my someone God. On my <laughs> you were like, is it a good shot? <laughs> I don't know what you were paying attention to. Oh, 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 oh. Lana's had a miracle comeback. She's on her last ball. Okay. If she hits this, she's actually going to be on the same. <gasps> oh my god. If you hit this, we've drawn. No. No. Damn. So that's actually going to be the last game we play. So the score is 1-1. One, one. She was so lucky in the last two shots. To be continued, guys. Woo, okay. Oh, look at that cat, guys. He's so cute. Look at the poor guy. What's up, man? That's chicken. That's nice. Yeah, there you go. He's eating that one. Yeah, he likes the chicken. He likes the chicken. Aw, he reminds me of Bubbles. Stay here and eat this, bud. Bye-bye, kitty. Hope you enjoy the food. He seems to just go back and forth between them. Okay, now he's eating the, the normal chicken. Look at him. Aw, I love helping cats out, man. They're adorable. Let's throw him some more for later. There you go. Oh, a whole leg? Isn't that a lot? Alright, don't worry. It looks like he's going to eat it. <laughs> Oh, he loves it. All right, there you go. He gave you some extras too. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> uh. Anyways, guys, I'm going to wrap up today's vlog here. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Tomorrow is going to be a big, hectic day. And my sister is going to go for an MRI scan. Today we actually went in for an emergency appointment because we reckoned it was a week and it was actually starting to hurt more and more. And we we're like, okay, she needs to go as soon as possible. So, touch wood, tomorrow nothing serious is going on. Hopefully it's just something small like a lack of vitamins or something, you know, tiny and nothing serious is going on. But... You never know, so that's why we had to get it checked up as soon as possible. Anyway, see you then, and yeah. Bye. Yolo. Bye. <laughs>